welcome back and if you're new welcome my name is Nikki don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell so that you're notified of all new uploads so today we're going to be unboxing the March Ipsy bag bag why did I say that like that bag so let's jump into it all right so if you're new to subscription boxes say that fast five times if you're new to subscription boxes Ipsy is ten dollars a month you get five beauty products they can either be full size or trial size you never know until you get the bag just if you're new here just a quick heads up I like to make these videos short and sweet because that's what you guys told me you want so you're not gonna get like detailed reviews or swatches if you want to see things like that check out the blog it is linked down below I actually have a giveaway going on on my blog right now for hundred dollars to for a gift card but these videos you guys told me you want them short sweet you want to see what's in the bag and then if you want to see any more detailed like I said close-ups and swatches check out the blog I'll link it down below all right, so let's jump into the bag. I like the bag so far, it's really pretty. One thing I wish Ipsy did is I wish they sent you like a list of the products and the prices. Almost all other subscription boxes do that. So first up, we have this Air Repair Complexion Boosting Moisturizer with Hyaluronic Acid, which is really, really good for your skin. This is definitely a tester size because this is 0.34 fluid ounces. And it says it's designed to dull, to rehydrate dull skin. Um, it's rich in homunculants, homunculants, humunculants, humunculants. Ugh, I butchered that. And antioxidants. Um, apply to freshly cleaned face day or night as needed. Let's smell it. Definitely a tester size, but let's give it a smell. Eww. Smells really fresh, kind of springy. Feels nice. Feels very lightweight. So that's cool. I've never heard of that brand, Air Repair. Next up, we have a Tarte Tartist lip paint. And what color is this? It doesn't have a color on it. Okay. See, that's why I wish they like gave you a list of the products with the names. It doesn't smell. Oh, it kind of smells chemically. That's what it, whoa, that's a lot brighter than I thought. Can you guys see that? And it has a little shine to it. It's a pretty color, but yee, that's bright. That's bright. I'm wondering how that's going to look on my skin tone. I might have to use a lip liner with it, but I don't know the name of it. There's like nothing to tell me the name, so sorry. Next up, we have this Freematic eyeshadow, and they've sent eyeshadows from this brand before. I think the brand is called Douce, Douce, it's D-O-U-C-C-E. So let's open it up, if I can get it open. Oh. oh man, last month they sent an eyeshadow like this in this like plastic kind of packaging and everyone was like, you're supposed to put it in the Z palette because I was like so upset that it looked like that. But I just like, come on. Do you guys see how small this is? Look at how small it is in relation to my hand. Like. I guess it's okay if you use a small eyeshadow brush. I don't know, it's just really small. Like when I see things this small, it actually steers me away from actually using it. It's a really pretty like um, kind of deep pink, almost deep mauve color. Let's swatch it there. Oh, it's a really pretty color. And it has, can you see that? It has a lot of shimmer in it, which is really pretty. I just, I don't know, the packaging just throws me off. I get it, you're just supposed to throw it in a Z palette, but it's just really small, but I guess you could get like a small shadow brush in there. It's a really pretty color, so, and I like the sheen it has to it. Uh, what's the actual name of the shade? It just says Freematic Eyeshadow. Is that the name of it? Hmm. I don't know. It's a pretty color. The packaging is kind of wild, but you just throw it in a Z palette and you're good to go. Next up are some te uh, teasers, tweezers in here, and it has this nice little plastic packaging. Oh. God, almost broke a nail. Oh, these are pretty. These are be good, and these are from the brand Chella. I've heard of Chella before. A lot of people use these to put eyelashes on. I don't. I prefer to use my fingers, but I mean, you could like pluck your chin hairs. <laughs> no shade. Like I have chin hairs, which is really disgusting. It's not disgusting, but I just. Why do I have that? I feel like I'm slowly morphing into a guy. That would be fine if I wanted that, but I don't. Anyways, I use these to pluck hairs. I know you can use them for any beauty products you want, like putting on um, eyelashes, like I mentioned, but I use them to pluck my hairs. <laughs> In case any of you cared. Oh my God, I'm a mess. 
And last up, we have, oh, they have, this is the Cake Desert Island Supreme Body Mousse. You know what? A couple of months ago, like recently, two months ago, Ipsy sent the cake, um, the cake lotion, and I love the smell of that. If any of you got that cake lotion, let me go get it for you. It's so good. Hold on. You guys see my pajama bottoms? <laughs> So last, I think it was like two months ago, they sent this body lotion and it's the Cake Heavy Cream. I love this stuff. It literally, so, oh my God, it smells like vanilla cake. I'm actually gonna order it online. I want a full size of this because this stuff is amazing. So when I see that they have this other body product from Cake, this is the Cake Desert Island. Oh, it's Deserted Island Supreme Body Mousse. So is this like a body wash? Uh... I think a body mousse is a lotion, right? I would think so. Let's open it up. Ooh, this one smells really good, but instead of smelling like cake, it smells more like um, coconut. It smells like coconut cake. Oh my God, this smells so good. I've got to go to this cake's website and order the stuff. So I really like this month's bag. I always grade them. Um, I don't know what grade I would give this. I wanna use them for a little bit, so check out the blog. I will link it down below. There's a giveaway on the blog for $100 Sephora gift card, and I will post a detailed review, and I always leave like my final grade at the end of the blog. So check out the blog for that. I unbox all my subscription boxes here, so make sure you subscribe. Uh, keep a look out, my BoxyCharm is coming on Monday. My Sephora Play Box is coming, so make sure you subscribe. If you want to check out my other subscription unboxings, I will put pictures of those videos here. So don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.